Thank you so much for taking time to speaking with us. Um, one of the most memorable uh, things uh, for me after seeing the result was the dance scene. So I have to ask how much oh, that you saw the dancing. You saw the dancing. That's great. Yes. Okay. I love it. I have to ask how much of that was choreographed or were some of those your own moves? It was 100% choreographed with my moves because I'm a terrible okay. dancer. I'm a terrible dancer. And I told the choreographer, like, it's going to be hard. I've done musicals, but I'm that guy who's going to be the last one to learn the moves. So you need to work with what you have, which is little. So, um, yeah, it, it, was, it was about making it very comfortable and silly and just me trying to do all the moves I learned when I was a teenager. You know, like those moves that you really know you can do in front of a crew with four, 400 people watching you. So I think it was, it was a lot of fun. It was great. It was like being in a real party with, with Gabby and the rest of the crew. And uh, I'm, I'm so glad you saw it because it's definitely one of my favorite moments in the show. Yes. Um, and it was one of the favorite moments of the crew when we were shooting. Like everyone was with the cameras. They were like, wow, this is incredible. So I think it's, um, it's definitely uh, an interesting turning point in the show. You know, being like, this show is, this show is never about what you think it's going to be. And that's, that exactly. keeps until the end. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. He healed it completely. So, honestly. Amazing. Yeah. Um, about your characters, because they're quite, I don't want to say shady, but we're not, the audience is not very sure about their motives. Um, were you aware of um, your character's development when you started shooting it? Or did you get them episode by episode? Did you get? No. So we, you knew what? We got all the information before. Gabby, if you want to. I mean, yeah, we got all the information, but also it kept on changing. So we were like, you know, in present all the time because you didn't know where, whether it was going to go this way or that way. But definitely we had a lot of information. Yeah. It was it was always, again, like I said, you never know what's, what's exactly going to happen. Uh, and it's a little bit the same with the performance. You know, like you, as an actor, you know where you're going, but you need to send... Uh, clues and hints to the other mm -hmm. direction so this the audience could be like oh what what the hell is happening now mm -hmm. so um yeah it was it was an interesting way of working with andy the showrunner was who's always always changing the scenes always yeah. trying to make them better to a point that you are like an actor you are like stop changing it please because <laughs> we we also we we speak spanish you know and most of the show is in english so i had like this 10 page monologues that I need to do. And he was changing it all the time. And I was like, dude, this is, this is not going to work. Stop changing the lines. They're good. And so um, was that what, what drew you to this project or what was um, the thing about this show that made you say, I have to Everything. be part of this? Everything. I mean, you look at it, it's the whole cast, the story, uh, like you said, it, it doesn't, it's a bit shady so you don't know like Louis said you don't know where it's going so, you know it could change and it can turn and and I've seen the first four episodes and I was like I mean I <laughs> I performed but I still I was like what's gonna happen next you know like um so yeah everything yeah for me it was like all the ingredients as Gabby was saying like um, I love Palm Springs, the first movie of Andy, Andy Sierra. I, I, I laugh so much watching that. I love Mr. Robot, and this is produced by the same producers of, of Mr. Robot and Homecoming and some of my favorite shows. So, uh, yeah, the ingredients were definitely uh, good. And also the themes, the themes of the show are fascinating. You know, like this show is about time. It's about how time destroys everything, destroys your body, destroys relationships, memory, uh, and I think that's a very fascinating topic for me and uh, to explore as an actor. Uh, and if you can explore that with comedy, it's even better. You know? Yeah, and it destroys it and also it heals. So yeah. Yeah. it heals it. That's, that's, that's the amazing thing about this show, that you can travel in time and realize all the things that are wrong, but all the things that are right. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much for taking the time to speak with us. Thank you, Solina. Thank you. Bye.